Hey everybody, we're at Diamond Shoe Loyal back again with another video. Today we're reacting to another Dharma video. Teachers help send poor kids to Disney World. What happens next is shocking. Let's get into this, guys. Has anyone seen Miss Flores? She's never late. Based on it, I haven't seen her. <sighs> Tasha, do you need some help? My zipper's stuck. Hmm. <sighs> hmm. Maybe if we make it slippery? Is there soap here? Mm, no. <laughs> Ooh, I have an idea. What's crayon gonna do? Does that really work? No, try. Whoa, thanks. How'd you know? What the heck? I'm gonna, I'm gonna try that for real next time I have a zipper that gets stuck. How to do that? You know, Miss Flores always says, sometimes you just need to use your imagination. No way, it's Mickey and Minnie Mouse. Hi, <gasps> kids. I'm Mickey. And I'm Minnie. And we can't wait for you to visit our home in Disney World all next week. Yeah! Mickey and Minnie? Duh. You're supposed to use your imagination, remember? <sighs> okay. Thank you so much for helping us out, Miss It Harris. is my pleasure. You kids have a good day now. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. 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 Okay. Who is excited to go to Disney World? Me! Okay, then. Let's take out our permission slips. I've always wanted to go to Disney World and still do want to go to Disney World. Our checks so I can collect them. M I C K E Y M O U S E. Thank you, Elena. Excellent. And where's your check? You don't have it? Oh, they need money. How about you, Joey? Do you have your check? That's one thing I didn't like about schools is that they would sit over here and try to take these kids on field trips, but then the parents needed to pay for the kids to go on this field trip. But I feel like if it's through the school, it should be free. You know, because I didn't ask you to take me on this field trip, you know. And then a lot of the kids' parents don't have money to just be given spending like that. You know what I'm saying? Does no one have their checks? Okay. Oh, here they are. Hey! Hey! Sweetheart, how are you, baby? I'm good. Ready to get going? Yes. Excellent. Hey. Excuse me. Hi. Sorry. I was wondering if maybe you guys had a, a moment to chat. Sure. Uh, hey, Tasha, why don't you and Joey and Alina go and wait in the car, okay? Okay. Great. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. Uh, is everything okay, Miss Flores? Oh, um, yeah, I was just, um, thinking maybe you guys might want to have a chat about Disney World. Because it's about a week away and no one has given me a check yet. Um, unfortunately, I just can't afford it. Especially after losing my job, we can barely keep the lights on right now. And I put all our savings into fixing our car. In fact, we've been having to take the bus everywhere while the car is getting fixed. Yeah, and Tasha's grandmother isn't doing so well, and so we moved her in with us. Yeah, so between taking care of somebody else and paying their medical bills, it's just not doable for us to send Tasha to Orlando. 
Wow, well, I had... I had no idea you guys were going through so much. Well, we feel terrible. Of course, the schools and the teachers... Of course, y'all won't think about that. You know what I'm saying? Because y'all just there to do y'all job to teach. But I feel like if y'all using the, the, the field trips as a teaching experience, that should be free. Because I'm not signing my kid up to go to school to be paying for field trips. I'm I'm sending them to school so they could get an education. So if y'all feel like that field trip gives them the education, that shit should be free. I'm just saying. Terrible. Tasha was so excited to go on her first plane ride. I mean, that's all she was talking about. Joey, too. He's never even been out of the state. Elena has never been out of Pittsburgh before, and it just breaks my heart having to tell her that she cannot go. Okay, well, let's not lose hope just yet. How about you guys give me a minute to talk to the principal and see if we can find some way to work this out? Oh, thank you so much, Miss Flores. You're a wonderful teacher, and you've done so much for our kids. Um, okay, fingers crossed. <laughs> it's really important that these kids go. For some of them, it might be their only opportunity to have an experience like this. And the parents aren't able to pay? No, I already talked to them. They can't afford it. Mm -hmm. Is there anything the school board could do? <sighs> I know. I know. It's just that they've been looking forward to this since the beginning of the year. We've never had a class not go. Trust me. It make you wonder, do these, do these schools really care about the students? Or are they just in it for the money? I mean... I know that the teachers need money, obviously, but I'm talking about the school board and the people way above the administrator and the principal of the school. You know what I'm saying? Like, do they really care about the students? Do the person that owns the school care about the students? Trust me, I hear you, but you know how the budget situation is. Yeah. Nobody asked right, how to well, take them on the field. Guess I gotta get back in there. That's all I'm saying. I'm sorry I keep pausing the video. I'm just saying, like, nobody asked y'all to take the kids on a field trip. I ain't asked you to take my kid on a field trip. Thanks. Does this mean we're not going? Um, uh, no. No, I, I, I'm going to find a way for us to get there. One way or another. But what are we going to do? Our parents can't pay for it, and the school won't give us any money. Well, Joey, what do I always say? Sometimes we're just gonna have to use our imagination. imagination. But what's that gonna do? Our imagination isn't gonna magically fly us to Disney World. What if we do a raffle? We could sell tickets and people can win prizes. But how are we gonna buy the prizes to raffle? And who's gonna buy the tickets? What about an auction? It's the same problem. Or we could do something for Valentine's Day. I mean, it's coming up. You know what, Elena? That's a really good idea. I think I know exactly what we're gonna do. Who wants to help me out this weekend? Me! 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 me, me. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Well, my dear, I'm glad everything went well this weekend. Oh, they got the money. It went way more than me. I actually have enough left over to buy the kids some school supplies. I'm not surprised. You all work so hard selling those flowers. Oh. Well, I'm at the bullseye, so I'm going to let you go. But I'll see you at school tomorrow. The kids are going to be so excited when I hand them those little Southwest plane tickets. Oh, yes, they will be. I'll see you tomorrow. OK, bye. What? Why is she out there counting the money and everything? And that guy's just walking around.
Um. Hey! No! Get back here! Hey! Wow. She wasn't even watching her surroundings, dude. Like, come on. And, and she counting the money right there out in the open. Hey! Miss Flores, we have a little surprise for you. We saved you some flowers and we made you this card as a thank you for everything you do for us. Yeah, you're the best teacher ever. Oh gosh, this is so sweet, which is going to make what I'm about to say so much harder. But first, I want to start by saying how absolutely proud I am of each and every one of you. You're all rock stars. But, unfortunately, um... What's wrong, Miss Flores? Um, the money... The money's gone. What? what? How? How? How what? happened? Uh, somebody broke into my car and stole the cash box yesterday after we were done selling the flowers. I'm really sorry. I should have been more careful. I don't deserve this. I'm the worst teacher ever. And I'm I just shocked that she didn't see this dude up on her back. Like, he was close enough that I would have been, like, turning around, looking over my shoulder. Really let you guys down. No, you didn't, Miss Flutter. We still love you. It's okay. You tried your best, and you didn't mean to lose the money. Mm -hmm. Please don't be sad, Miss Flores. I'm so sorry, kids. You gotta stop beating up on yourself about this, hon. How could I not? It's all my fault. Hush. You did more for those kids than most teachers would have done. It's all for nothing now. <laughs> That's not true. You showed those kids that you care, and that goes a long way. Yeah. Well, I can't buy tickets with caring. All I had to do was not leave the cash box in the car. I felt like, well, had she not opened it out in the open, the dude wouldn't even have thought to even break into her car. He only did that because he saw her counting the money. I want to give my last dollar so those kids can quit Disney. All I have left is the $300 that I put aside for the school supplies. I was this close to buying the Southwest airline tickets and booking the flights. Everything was planned. This is going to be the first class to not go to Disney and it's all my fault. Well, if we can't take them to Disney, we can bring Disney to them. I don't know what you mean. It's like you always say. Sometimes you have to use just a little imagination. If I'm telling the truth, what am I to say? Good morning, everyone. I'm Captain Harris. Your flight with service to Orlando, Florida will be boarding shortly. Gather your belongings and head to your assigned gate. Wait, I don't get it. Yeah, I thought we aren't going to Disney anymore. You won't be if you missed your flight. Oh, you'll need these to get on the plane. Here, come. 
That's where you'll Whoa. be boarding. These are so cool. Wait, so are we supposed to go to room 304? Gate 304. That's where you'll be boarding. Now, don't dilly-dally. You don't want your captain to take off without you. Here you go. Let's go. Aww. Here we go. Miss Flores, what's going on? There's no time for explanation. Your flight is boarding. Oh, you you using them their imagination. Boarding pass, please. Elena? Yes, ma'am, that's you. Bloop. Enjoy your flight. Thanks. Boarding pass, please. Mr. Joey. Yes, that's you. Bloop. Enjoy your flight. Thank you. Miss Tasha. Welcome aboard. Welcome aboard. Welcome aboard. Here you go. Ethan. Thank you for flying with us again, Mr. Ethan. Bloop. Enjoy your flight. All right, bye. Bye. Ladies and gentlemen, this is your captain speaking. We have reached our cruising altitude of 36 thousand feet. Wow. wow! Our cabin crew will begin their in-flight service. Complimentary snacks and beverages are available for your enjoyment. Yeah, I would have been happy with just this, the snacks. Hey, I'm good for the rest of the night. Wow, we're so high up. I know, this is crazy. I can see Australia from here. Wow. <laughs> Just look at the castle! Look at this! Oh my gosh! Awesome! That's so cute! Welcome to Disney World, the happiest place on Earth! Uh, may I see your tickets, please? Uh, we don't have tickets. Are you sure about that? Did you check your luggage? Tickets. All right, let me scan these tickets and you can enter. Uh, Amazing, you are in. Enjoy your time at Disney. Yeah. Have fun on Space Mountain. Perfect. Troy. Space Mountain. You're in. Yeah, Have a blast. Down, Have yeah, fun. That's enjoy enjoy, your enjoy. Time. Here we go. Have fun Please on so. Thunder Mountain Railroad. see the castle? Oh, uh, I think Cinderella Castle's closed today. What? But I thought the castle's never closed. Uh, how about we do the Nemo submarine? Or it's a small world. I want to go in the Haunted Mansion. Can we please? Oh, I'm uh. sorry, guys, but I think we'd have to go to Rio Disney World to do all of that. I tried my best. They couldn't get every single thing they had at Disney World, but they got a lot of the similar things, you know? But I know it's not the same. Why would you guys say anything? Now you made her feel bad. I'm sorry, Miss Flores. I didn't mean to make you feel bad. No, no, I'm the one that's sorry. I wish that I could do more for each and every one of you. I mean, it really is my fault that we didn't get to go in the first place. No, no, this uh. is more than enough. Right, guys? Yeah! yeah. <laughs> okay. 
Disney World Thrill Field Light. Please stand clear of the door. Welcome, foolish man. Or manténganse... I have a huge surprise for you. Wednesday? Really? Oh, <laughs> she did it. They get to go to Disney World. Oh, 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 not oh, yet. Oh. Good job. Good job. Thank you so much. I still can't believe Southwest Airlines reached out. Well, everyone was really moved by that video. You did a remarkable. Some things happen for a reason, man. Good job with those kids. Oh, we did. It was a group effort. Hey, I can't see Australia from here. I see it right there. Where? I don't see it. Come on, guys. Sometimes you just have to use your imagination. Hmm. <laughs> Sonya White created a, a pretend vacation for students, complete with passports and plane tickets and gifts. Aww. This is the real one. That's so sweet. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned. I'll be back with more videos and I'm out.